up everybody it's titanium feet jack and i'm back at you again with another video uh this sneaker we're about to look at is one of my favorite sneakers to release this year in 2024 but before we get into all of that i need a couple things from you guys i need you to hit that like button do hit that thumbs up button on the video leave a comment down below in the comment section let me know your thoughts on the video and the sneaker itself do hit that notification bell and sub up to the channel if you haven't already now today this sneaker like i mentioned earlier it is one of my favorite sneakers to release this year in 2024 so uh i'm not gonna hold you too long uh it is a nike sb i'm not sure where these will rank in nike sb or even in your guys sneaker of the year conversation but uh, it is definitely up there for me as I show you what the box would look like. Uh, your boy struck out on the sneakers app release as I show you the uh, box label of the sneaker. Uh, I also entered a few raffles. I struck out on that as well. So I had to reach out to my good buddies at eBay Sneakers. eBay Sneakers, I was able to get these all for eBay Sneakers for a good price since i purchased these the price has gone up so i purchased at the right time before the uh price went up even higher so uh let's go ahead and read this it says a nike sb don't glow og qs qs standing for quick strike uh and the color is bleach aqua and geo teal and white and this is a size 14 these are for the toe and i believe the retail on these was like 115 or 125 us dollars but as you guys know when you have to buy off their secondary market it gets a little pricey so uh as i show you that box uh i'm sorry that that lot number right there here you go the paper you got that print on here is glossy on one side a little rough on the other uh extras in here you do get a sticker if i can actually grab it your boy doesn't have any fingernails but uh here you guys go it does come with the white on white nike sb sticker if you guys can focus in on that and at the bottom or in the side of the box you do have a green and white YCM sticker. Uh, we do have additional laces, but you guys been following my channel long enough. You know Nike SB extra laces are affixed to the sneaker. So let's get into the review. Here you go, guys. We have the Nike SB Don't Glow OG, the Futura Laboratories in the Aqua Bleach colorway. Let me know your thoughts on this sneaker of uh, me i had to have these these were a pair i had to have and if you notice that this sneaker is all canvas and you really have to protect your sneakers protect your investment so what other better way to do that is we're treating your sneakers with the rejuvenator water and stain repellent you see me use rejuvenator before but uh I definitely used them on these sneakers before I actually recorded this video. But uh, let's get into the sneakers. A little background on these. Uh, Futura Laboratories is a company. Uh, they started around 1997 uh, as Futura Laboratories. And they also used to be known as Futura as well. Uh, there's an artist, he's from Brooklyn, he makes canvas paints and all that good stuff. And he partnered with some people at institutions such as Martha Cooper, Salehi Bembry, just to name a couple in the museum of Brooklyn, you know, and Chicago and all kind of other stuff. But they do have their flagship store over there in japan as i show you the iced out bottom of the sneaker but to get more into the sneaker itself it is made on an all white canvas all white canvas base as you can see the quarter panels and a toe box they left that white 
Now going down your mud, your mud guard and your lace eyelets and going around your heel. They do have a paint or a different color abstract. This is part of the work of the uh, guy of Futura Laboratories because he actually started out as a painter around the time I was born or uh, walking around in diapers in the uh, late 70s. Uh, unique sneaker, very, uh, very colorful. As you guys know, that's right up my alley. Now my question is, are every pair of these exactly the same? For you guys out there that have multiple pairs, let me know in the comment section, are all the pairs exactly the same or there are differences and each shoe will be different. That's the one intriguing question that I have. The quality control on my pair appears to be pretty good. Uh, shout out to eBay again. This came with the sneaker and you uh, have that card. And you can see on this one right here, the eBay tag. And you do have that QR code, authenticity guarantee. The Nike swoosh is kind of uh, suede in that uh, GOTL colorway. And you got the Futura Laboratory signature on the lateral heel right there. You got a white uh, midsole, and you can see that aqua bleach threading going in there. And you have sort of a translucent outsole at the very hit right there at the bottom. And you do have the signature of Futura Laboratories right there as well. Looking at the heel of the sneaker, you do have a uh, material right here. It's like grayish or silverish. It feels like it may be 3M. Uh, and you have Nike and white on there as well. Moving to the medial side of the sneaker, you do have the FL, which stands for Futura Laboratories. You have that branding on the sneaker on the medial side as well. I forgot to mention that red uh, lace eyelet right there. That probably stands for something. Uh, not sure because I know the friends and family pair, it has a white. I'm sorry, a yellow red uh, hole right there. A red uh, lace hole. It actually stands for something. Now I have to research that in a little bit. Uh, and we was on the medial side. You got that GOT swoosh right there. And you have this stitch pattern on top right here. And the uh, appears to be like a soft yellow colorway. You got more of that uh, white canvas on your quarter panel like I mentioned earlier. And you can see more of the uh, artwork of the artist on the sneak on the overlays, the lace eyelets going around your mud guard. Let's, uh, I did mention they did come with additional laces. These are the additional laces. It come affixed to the right sneaker, guys. So if you like me after buy these on the secondary market, Make sure you get a good pair. Let's get this out of here. Come stuff with tissue. There you go, brown tissue. Give you guys a closer look at the toe box. There you go. And they got this aqua bleach sort of uh, oval laces. You can see it's like a, a teal trimmed in a, a bleach purple halfway up and then you get the purple for the rest of the way you got a nylon tongue you got the fat tongue and you have a woven patch it's a collab patch futura laboratories you got the nike swoosh on here and it says nike sb as well and you got that uh, uh bleach purple uh piping going around here at the top and this is the back part of the tongue tag. Uh, let's see, can I locate the uh, size and tag in here? Production date, well actually this is a size 14, as you guys may know. And the production date is December 6th of 2023 to February 16, 2024. So about a month of production. So. That tells me this sneaker was pretty, pretty limited. Uh, 
give you guys a look of the insert it does come out if I can get it out of here in a safe and timely manner set that aside this is what the insert looks like you guys are closer up of the insert you got all that on here Futura Laboratories branding, Nike SB branding, and you got the signature and Nike Dunks in an alternated color pattern. And this is the bottom of your SB insert. So let me know your thoughts on the sneaker and where it ranks for you and your sneakers for 2024. I have a good feeling these are going to be on a lot of people countdown. The top 24 top sneakers of 2024 that is but uh we're about halfway through the year so we'll see where the end of the year leads us but uh we're gonna go ahead and end this video like i always tell you guys if you can help somebody get a sneaker help them get that sneaker because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker i'm titanic feed jack i'm signing out